but Leah Lane Lyon is in the park this morning. Lane obviously putting together this event. Huge deal. Takes a lot of effort by a lot of people. And I have to tell you, Civic Center Park has never looked better. We are ready for the big event tonight. This is the eighth annual free community celebration for Independence Eve. It's a great way to kick off the 4th of July. And up early with us is Eric Lazari from the Civic Center Conservancy. Thanks for waking up. Absolutely, glad uh, to be here. And I'll tell you, you guys look like you're ready. We are ready. We are ready. There'll be a little. There'll be a little bit of tweaks uh, later on today, but uh, we got most of the setup done yesterday. You're expecting a hundred thousand people to this event. For those who haven't uh, been here or familiar with it, what can we expect here on the on Denver's front lawn? Um, we can expect a phenomenal concert. We can expect an amazing light show. We can expect fireworks to cap it all off. It's really become Denver's largest picnic. We're going to have people here probably from three o'clock until the end of the fireworks show, just gathering here in this wonderful space in the heart of our city. Okay, give us some quick details. What time does the program start? Um, concert will start at eight o'clock. Um, fireworks are going to be at about 9.30 p.m. And um, other than that, come out and enjoy. Okay, food, light show, fun. Yes, yes, exactly. Our food trucks will be ready to serve probably starting at 3 o'clock, 4 o'clock. So whenever you get down here, plenty of food, chance to get that. Was that 3 a.m. or 3 p.m.? Because we've got one behind us. <laughs> they, are, they are here early, but they will be ready to serve the public at about 4 p.m. Okay, Eric, awesome. Speaking of food trucks, take a look who it is. Mandy, I've never been on board a food truck before. Is it okay if I come in here? Okay. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, it's a big step. Yeah, this is Mandy Smith, everyone. She's Hi with there. the Croc Spot. Yes. You'll be here later today as well. Absolutely. What are you cooking up? Well, we have a build-a-bowl menu, so we're going to have a lots of different things today but in this particular bowl we have the jasmine thai fried rice a southwestern chicken topped with some sauteed veggies our world famous chimichurri sriracha sour cream and topped with a fresh basil corn salad it sounds amazing Hearty and healthy even at 5 30 in the morning That's i'm right. hungry <laughs> hey can you show us a couple of the ingredients because when i think of crock pot inspired food truck yes i'm thinking of maybe some uh, pot pies some you know some uh, stews yes. things like that y yep yep so we have a little bit of, well, you can't see it over here, but we have a vegan curry that would be going in here. Um, this is our jasmine Thai fried rice with some kale in it. I think he's going to try to come in here. Hi, Eddie. Come on in. You ever been in a food truck before? Uh, yes, I have. Oh, Many times. So this is our jasmine Thai fried rice. This is our southwestern chicken. So when a patron comes up, we grab a bowl. They tell us what base they want, what protein they want, and then what other toppers that they'd like to have with them, whether it's some veggies or or if they like to have some of the corn salad and um, sauces. So we have a wide variety of, of goodies for everybody. Okay, Mandy Smith, thank you so much. It smells wonderful thank here. You. Of course, all of this is part of Independence Eve. We will be here all morning long telling you what to expect, including some of this great food, and we will have some great music later. Thanks for, for getting aboard here, Addy. We appreciate it. <laughs> Send it back to you guys in the studio. Amazing, Lane. You better bring some of that back. <laughs> Looks delicious. I know. We all want breakfast. Food trucks are the best, by the way. Yeah.